Morning everybody. Uh, <clears throat> on the line today, checking some traps. Uh, just, uh, I think, checked five so far, and uh, oh, this is a fresh catch. He's uh, probably this morning. Yeah, so. Anyway, a good catch. Um, another Martin. So we'll uh, get him out of here. It's good we can reuse this trap, so. Uh, <clears throat> bait still looks good, so fairly warm today. Uh, did some more baiting for coyotes. Uh, gonna feed them hard, I guess, and uh, hopefully next week we'll uh, get out there and hammer the snares out. Only got, I think, that dozen or 14 snares out right now, so um, we shall get to her next week. What I like to do is, like I said, just loop a little uh, branch through the eyes just to keep it. Uh, these particular boxes, these slots are a little wider than I'm uh, making now, so. And what I'll do is just tuck in uh, <coughs> tuck in some spruce boughs there, and use a little bit of lure. I uh, like to put some at the base of the tree, and I like to put the stick on top, uh, just to uh, get it out in the air a little bit more. And last and not least, rub the uh, tree with a little bit of uh, bait, beaver meat, so. And that's it. Good to go. Um, I make my sets where they're kind of qu quick and simple. Uh, you're in, you're out. Uh, I don't have to play around too much. So that's it. So uh, we'll continue on. The sun's kind of trying to peek out of the clouds today. And like I said, it's fairly warm. So take care, everybody. We'll talk to you soon. Let's check here. Oh, unfortunately, it's a female, but. Oh well, that's the way it goes. Hey again everybody, uh, still checking some Martin traps and uh, approaching the set I can see something hanging there, so take a peek and see what it is. Uh, it looks like a Martin, so. Sorry for the uh, Last video there, I wasn't quite in frame when I was talking or picking up that other Martin, but uh, next time I'll try to do better. So there we go. Looks like a uh, it's a nice dark one. I'll just put my tail down and take a better look at him. Get the gloves off here. And yeah, this one's been here for for a while. He's frozen. The other one was soft. So yeah, nice. Uh, Nice dark colored one. This box has kind of on a little bit of a leaning, leaning pole here. So well, let's get another Martin. Uh, yeah, perfect. Nice catch again. Quick dispatch. So the LDL 120s are working, I guess. So it's kind of clouded over here. Uh, it's about two o'clock or so, I think. So. We'll uh, continue on. Don't have too many more to check, but uh, we'll uh, carry on, see if there's anything else today. Hey there again, everybody. Um, looks like we're coming to another set here, and looks like we connected on another Martin. There was one, uh, first time I checked this set, there was one around the base that the trap was closed, and uh, but uh, looks like we connected on him this time, so. You can see him in the distance there, so hopefully he's good. Let's just take a peek. Yeah. There he is, so. Looks like a fairly good size one, I think, or hard to say. 
nice catch in the trap. Not quite uh, frozen, so uh, well, that's good. That's uh, another one for the fur bag. So we have one more uh, box just uh, across a little trail here. So like I said, I always uh, try to set two boxes uh, in close proximity. So anyway, got a Martin. We'll uh, get him out and continue checking traps. Hello again everybody, we are uh, just picked up that Martin and uh, here's a good reason why I, uh, I set two boxes in uh, close proximity. Sometimes when you have a fairly good mo Martin population, here we go, we got another one. Nice uh, dark looking one, so <clears throat> had a lot of uh, wind damage to the tree so it makes walking to the sets kind of kind of miserable, but uh, this is a nice, nice dark chocolate looking one, so the, uh, the little branch works to hold the trap in, but uh, I just put it in so uh, it just uh, it pops out so he can free hang, so perfect, another good catch, another good Martin, so perfect, we'll uh, continue on. Hopefully we'll uh, pick someone else up today. Talk to everybody later.